Make sure to yep. subscribe, follow the channel, subscribe to the YouTube channel so I can start making money. Yes! All yep. right, we are seeing the puff come Very out here. Very grateful to all the support for Boardwalk Smash, as well as the, the O brand. T-O-V-O. Again, the game one here go. on PS2. Go. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I, love, I love run back egg into dash shield. Not even in center. And this is what we can pretty much expect to see for the rest of the set. Yeah, this is a slow burner right here. Absolute slog, but we know that neither of these competitors are exactly shy to oh. taking the slow route in order Hockey, to catch their Hockey's victory. got the lead. Yeah. One thing, I definitely think Hockey as a player has kind of mellowed out in his play style. I yeah. feel like he used to be a lot more aggressive, and it almost came off as, like, impatient sometimes, but he... Especially with the pound usage, that's a pretty common habit. But I really feel like he's gotten so much better lately. And oh! <laughs> he's the roll Hockey with the, the roll classic. and read. He is, that's Jigglypuff 101. What you doing there? We this love is that. my zone. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. But Hockey's, Hockey's gotten so much better, especially with the pound Ooh, usage. X smash read Right there. when I say that, commentator's curse. He starts the pound and this input. Down here for big damage. Forward air not quite catching the second place. I love Electron just controlling this zone here, but is able to get his zone broken uh, by Hockey Saibi there. down B. Works out for him, I guess, but... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hockey is doing a really good job of weaving in and out of Electron's shield. Mm -hmm. With the shield pressure, he'll, he'll do a move like down air, where he can safely drift away, and the down air sort of covers him. And Electron, you know, Yoshi with, what, frame 3, frame 4 nair is very prone to clicking that out of shield, but... Oh, oh and another you already rest know what's coming. Here. Ooh! It's the rest! And I don't think he's dying here. Nope. All right, Matches him there, lacking the egg. on the platform. Really good setup, but Electron goes deep, calls him out, says, "I know you're gonna, I know you're gonna fade back." So here's a forward air for your trouble. Absolutely. It's really threatening uh, Hockey Shield there by using these down beats to land. And what I really like about what he's been doing here with his pressure, once he sends Hockey above him, he's actually going back down because he knows that Jigglypuff has enough air drift yeah. to get out of the way of certain punishes. All things considered, you could not tell this is a bad matchup the way Hockey's been playing this. No, absolutely. He's, he's been weeping. doing a phenomenal job of just catching Electron in those key moments where Yoshi just gets hit. Yeah, the zone breaking has been very impressive so like far right from Hockey. right there, man. He, he catches him right there. He... Trying to Ooh, read a roll in there. Dude. That was great. He just says, what you doing in shield? Just because I jabbed you? No. All right, good. Oh, Back to no. catching the forward air there. Applying pressure with these Hold other forward on. This could be bad news for hockey. He manages to get out the corner, though. Oh! That's it. That's yeah. attack going to do it. Hockey takes game one. It was looking very convincing. Electron found some momentum, but it wasn't enough. Yeah, just ended up swinging at something he shouldn't have, and ended up getting punished for it. Yeah, it wasn't a bad, it wasn't a bad read though. It was very close to hitting. He just, he was like, maybe he drifted he in. Wanted, he wanted hockey to jump and drift in. Exactly. And but, uh, you know, it almost worked, but not, not what he needs. The majority the of hockey's zone breaking this set so far has been from side B, and not quite fair back air. So I could see why Electron would expect him to come in, but at that percent, it just was not worth it. Yeah, definitely not. And. As the combo percent start to, as percent start to rise, Jigglypuff is less prone to use the side B because it stops comboing. Exactly. It does eventually kill, but at a really high percent and an even higher percent on a big stage like Town and City. But here we go. I feel like Electron is starting to overuse this down B at a disadvantage here. Like, yeah, you could get lucky with it, but Hockey clearly knows that it's coming at this point. Yeah. It, it's really cool the way that the Hockey is like absolutely weaving around all these options yeah. here. Double jump armor able to get him back to center stage. Yeah, the pound usage and the down air usage have been really good by Hockey. But Electron, no slouch. He kept it very close, almost took game one. and Oh, nice air dodge. Oh, but the reverse nair into the, the stock. foot air. Absolutely. Beautiful conversion. Electron went too deep, no jump. Hockey capitalizing right away, saying, you're not close enough to the stage, so let me, let me take this stock real quick. Strange that Electron thinks that the problem is that he's not pushing advantage hard enough when, from what we've seen, it's really just been him over committing. Ah. See, great read there, reading the fade back smash. instead of the fade forward. I just don't know if offstage is really the place you want to be fighting against. Jigglypuff fair into is, rest at 50% center stage. That it's gonna is kill. exactly what he needed. He is exactly where he wants to be right here. Upper out of shield, gonna take that stock, first stock. He has a full stock lead on Electron here on the big stage of Town and City. Set is moving surprisingly fast for the matchup that we're looking at right now. Hockey! Oh no! Oh, he Electron missed a put in. And Hockey 
is in winner's finals. This is the run of his Wait, life. I didn't even like consider the fact that if he wins, he goes on to guarantee third. 